welcome back guys to another episode to another horror game the power man so you wake up in the park in the middle of the night has someone trapped you you go to escape without getting caught difficulty oh 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 I'm gonna go with Nightmare. I want a challenge today, guys. Let's see how nightmarish this is. Oh no, did I fall asleep on this bench? What, in the children's bit? Uh, you know, I should get home now. Why did you fall asleep in the children's bit for a start? That is the question. Do you not have a child? Do you have a child? If you did have a child, where is said child? Said child is not here. Um, trash. It's just trash. Um, is this like children of the corn or something in the bloody park? I don't know. Can they go in the swing? Oh, I like that. Um... I'm very intrigued to see how nightmarish this actually is going to be, how difficult it's going to be. I have a feeling I'm not going to do too well. I mean, it's already rather ominous. It's set in the scene pretty well straight away with um, how uh, uncomfortable this all is. I mean, I don't really feel that this is a park. Ah, I don't know what that is. I died. Oh god, I didn't like that. Um, I'm gonna try Nightmare again. I'm gonna go the other way this time. Now off we go. To... Get out of here. I really feel like I'm really small. Like a burrower or something okay um that's not weird at all flowers okay very nice very nice flowers but how do i get out of here there's a shed cabinet cab okay it's locked it's locked seeds why is there another oh it's not another door it's just me imagination all right get off it is feeling it gets a little bit sticky stocky sometimes um i'm guessing this is the right way based on the traps but this guy is rather fast trash it's just trash it's just trash I have a feeling he's going to appear in a minute. 482. I'm going to have to remember that. I hear some, like, I say I hear something, the atmosphere is just getting rather intense. Am I going the right way? I don't know. But I have found, what was it, 482? I can't remember. Four. Right, I'm going to see if that guy has the same code. Because if he does, that'd be fantastic. I can go straight to the suitcase and put in whatever it was for it to. But is it going to be the case of... It, it changes every time. I don't know. Right, is this the same code? 482, perfecto. Let's go to the suitcase, wherever the suitcase is. Or is this bugger going to find me again? Four... Eight, two. I have a key for, I'm guessing, uh, that locked bit. Don't know. I'm trying to do this quickly because of Mr. Powerman charging after me. Rather, rather uncomfortably weak. Please give me a chance. Please give me a chance. Come on, come on, come on. I think this is where I'm going. I'm kind of just obviously winging it. Yeah, well, I've got a key. Unlock it. Apparently, this is not what I'm... Frickin' spider. Maybe, maybe it's for something else. Or do I use a different... I don't know. Is there a different way to unlock it? 
metal cabinet. I guess it's not for the metal cabinet. Maybe it's for... Oh, go away. I need to know what that um, key's for. Because I have no idea. Unless it's back the other way, but I don't know if I'm going to come across him straight away back there. I kind of want to find where that key goes before I do anything else. But I'm also interested to know if he'll just turn back up here if this is like his first spawn point or if he's just kind of randomly generated. No, that's his spawn point. Right. So I can go straight to the suitcase and get that key to save a bit of time and then just figure out where I've got to go, I guess. But who is this pale man? Why is he so pale? Where is the suitcase? The suity suity suitcase. Right, I've gone where I didn't want to go. Right. For... No. <laughs> Right, give me my key. Right, get. I, I sometimes feel I get stuck on stuff when there's not necessarily anything there. Um, hang on, what's this? Right, what's the shovel for? Oh, no, 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 no. Can I attack you? No. I cannot attack it, so. I'm guessing the shovel is for the flower bed. Straight to the suitcase. Straight to the shed. And then straight to the flower bed. Right, four, eight, two, now give me this key. Right, and then there was a shed somewhere right here. Right, give me the shovel. Oh. Go away, 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 So I can't go that way. I need to go back through the woods. Come on. Chip, chop, chip, chop, ship, chop, chop, chop. I like the fact this person's saying I should get home right now. And then they just find a random body and thinks, I'm going to open this suitcase. Like, in theory, what is stopping them from just not trying to find the way home? I mean, maybe I just haven't ventured, ventured, ventured far, far enough afield. Um, right, I've just balls this up completely with where I'm going. And now I've gone, oh, there you are. I think next time I'm just going to go um, along the road rather than trying to figure out exactly um whereabouts it is in the woods because i keep buggering this up and i forgot what i was saying but there's no surprise there there must be a way to escape him right i'm gonna go back through the woods i don't know if this is the right thing to do Mirrors are getting a bit foggy. Uh, where is this flower bed stuff? Here it is. This is just a guess. Right, is this for this? Aha! Bolt cutters. I'm guessing this is for the bit next door. I'm guessing he uses the main road. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Have I done it? Have I escaped? Have I escaped? 
You managed to escape, but the Power Man will still hunt your dreams forever. Hey, I did that in Nightmare as well. Um, fantastic. Thank you for playing. You're very welcome. And that, guys, was the Pale Man. Loved it. I loved the tension and atmosphere straight off the bat with the music and the gritty graphics. And the Pale Man himself was definitely creepy. However, I would have loved to have found some notes around the park either explaining the Power Man or giving a bit of folklore behind what he was. And I also feel the difficulty wasn't too difficult. E either that or I'm just far too good. But it was a great little game and I'll certainly be keeping my eye open for any future games by the developer. That's it for today guys, but if you enjoyed the video then please hit the like button and if you'd like to see more then don't forget to subscribe. Otherwise, I'll see you next time.